Hello everyone, welcome to Infija. In this video, we are going to solve one basic exponential equation. Why I am saying basic? We'll talk about equation is 3 power x equal to negative 3. While solving this problem, we will see complex number, we will see exponential equation, exponent, exponent properties, algebraic manipulation, and then we will conclude our answer in complex form. As we are talking about complex solution, why real solution is not there? See left hand side having one function which is monotonic increasing above the x axis. It is not going or crossing x axis. This is our x axis. This is our y axis. And graph is this function. It is 3 power x. Now come to the function which is right hand side that is negative 3. A line which is parallel to x axis passing through y equal to negative 3. If you will see there is no intersection. Because of no intersection we can conclude no solution is possible. So here our statement is no solution possible. Is possible. Okay, second approach we can think about. Many approach can possible, you can consider the algebraic way also. Second approach is I will take ln both sides. Okay, let me take ln. ln 3 power x is equal to ln of negative 3. So left hand side we will apply the rule of logarithmic property x ln 3 that there would be and right hand side we haven't taken ln of negative number, logarithmic of negative number. Why? It is undefined, not defined. It is not defined because of we are thinking about real solution. So here it is not defined. So you will write no real solution is possible. No real solution is possible. That means complex solution is possible. Because of we can write minus 3 in complex form. So that time ln would be defined. Because we are trying to find out complex solution. So third approach would be we will find out the possible solution which is complex solution. So let's find out complex solution how. I will write 3 power x times equal to 3 times negative 1. Divide both sides by 3. Let me divide. So, equation will convert 3 power x over 3 equal to negative 1. Now, it will be 3 power x minus 1 equal to negative 1. And because we are finding out complex solution, I will write minus 1 plus 0 by 4. Now, we can represent through argon plane. Let me draw that plane and then we will take up through polar form. So if I will plot this one, minus 1 plus 0 y, that would be somewhere here, minus 1 comma v. On real axis, this is real z and this is imaginary z, 0. So that point, that complex number is, let's call z. So if z in Cartesian it is written as minus 1 plus 0 i, I am generalizing it. If it is a plus i b, then in polar form z can be written r e raised to the power i theta, where r is square root real part e square plus imaginary part e square and theta is tan inverse imaginary part over real part. So let's apply because we have our z that is a equal to minus 1 and b equal to 0. Let's put here the values. Okay. So r will be under the root negative 1 square plus 0 square. That value will come out. Negative 1 square is 1. 1 plus 0 is 1. Square root 1 is 1. Okay, this is radius of unit circle. It is coming out 1 because of. 
ओके नाउ कम टू थीटा टेन इनवर्स यू कैन सी इजिली थीटा इज इक्वल टू फाइव बाई यूजिंग फॉर्मूला बी ओवर ए आई विल राइट जीरो ओवर नेगेटिव वन दैट वैल्यू विल बी फाइव नाउ लेट्स राइट इन यूलर्स फॉर्म तो जेड विल बी इक्वल टू आर तो दैट इज वन ई रेस्ट टू द पार आई फाइव और z इज इक्वल टू ई रेस्ट टू द पार आई फाइव मीन्स अवर राइट हैंड साइड इज ई रेस्ट टू द पार आई फाइव फॉर अ पर्टिकुलर सोल्यूशन ओके रिमेंबर we have to put the value in the given equation 3 par x minus 1 equal to e raised to the power i by x minus 1 equal to e raised to the power i by this is particular solution because in the interval 0 to 2 by now let's generalize this how we will generalize in case of in place of exactly i Pi, I would write pi plus two n pi. Okay, where n belongs to integer. Let's take pi common. E raised to the power i pi. One plus two n, which is equal to three power n minus x minus one. All right. Now we have to find out the value of x. That would be our solution okay how i can write i will write 3 as change of base e raised to the power ln 3 so 3 power x minus 1 i will write e power ln 3 whole power x minus 1 so this value will be e power x minus 1 ln 3 so let's put here i will write e raised to the power X minus one, ln three, is equal to e par i pi two n plus one. Because our base, both sides are same, exponent must be same. So I will write x minus one. This term should be equal to this. X minus one, ln three, equal to i pi. 2n plus 1. So x minus 1 divide both sides by ln 3. i pi 2n plus 1 over ln 3. So x will be add 1 to both sides. 1 plus i pi 2n plus 1 over ln 3. Okay, this is our Final answer in complex, which is the possibility there. There were no real solution; only complex solution were possible. And how we will calculate? How we can find out using mathematics? This is how in this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye bye till next video.